As you can see, we do not throw out our egg containers. I've been saving them and saving them, and now I have a use for it. So after you cut them out like this, I also cut out the middle part, like the skeleton of what was left after I cut the egg uh, basket. Um, then you will glue them together. And I'm using this tacky glue. I've had this for a while. Um, I actually got this from a quilting place but you can use any kind of super tacky glue and I'm just going to be using a brush so let me set this aside this is going to be another fun thing we can do with this nothing will go to waste that's for sure um okay so what you need to do next which i've done with this one for example i kind of already trimmed them so that they can they're like perfect like this so since i'm making golden eggs for my grandkids we're going to be doing a easter egg hunt this sunday I will put a quarter on here inside the golden egg because that's supposed to mean money, right? So I'm making a few of these. So like this, for example, as you can see, they're not closing. There's like a gap. So if you look at it, it just needs to be trimmed, okay? And I'm not going to be too particular about it. This should be okay. I think this part needs to be trimmed. And then we start uh, gluing them together. So now what I'm gonna do is take a quarter this is for um, the Easter egg hunt. And then I will just take a brush. And start gluing them. So after just try to fit them together. For those of you who likes to use glue gun, you can probably do that like glue gun this together
after you're done putting in the money inside it can be quarters it can be a dollar now we are going to be painting them but first we need to prep them by uh, poking a hole through uh, one of the sides so this way we can uh, paint them and let them dry so I have this all thing but they're not that hard you can probably use whatever it is the, to poke holes and then I'm just going to stick them into a styrofoam like this and uh, we can start painting them so I'm going to be using a metallic gold paint and I'm just going to pour it here in this uh, plastic container. I'm going to be painting one of these pink because I have a grandson who loves pink. That would come out nice, I think. So here we go. The fun part will be just painting them. I'm not too concerned if there's little gaps like that. We can cover them with a trim. I did one and I just cover it with a trim. And besides, the kids would probably want to break this open <laughs> to get the quarters. So I'm not too concerned about that. So this is what we do. We just paint, paint, paint very relaxing project and then uh, then we're done so there is our golden painted eggs i paint this one pink um and you have the option of putting trims around it and what i did i just used this uh, trims they're like stickers and they actually just easily stick on there I don't put it right at the seam but a little bit above so it sticks better and I just got that from the dollar store so I hope you like today's video happy Easter